Hey Dave, just wanted to show you my trims are all perfectly centered on there and then got everything lined up. This actual works beautifully. And it's all sitting right at zero all the way down the line. Um, got rid of a lot of the need for, um, well, any need for sub trim. And uh, everything else works really nice. I, just, I was just going to show you too. I've got my throttle centered right now uh, with the throttle cut off. off. When I flip it on, you can see it goes 100% throttle. Um, I did. I took my radio apart last night and found that it, it was in my radio. Somehow they switched around channel 2 and 3, which made channel 3 run backwards. Um, it's like they took a mode 2 remote and put the electronics in for a mode 1 remote and then just tried to program it away. And that didn't work very well. But just wanted to say thanks for the software. And uh, it just seems to be all working really great. Uh, I ran through the calibration twice and everything is working great. I don't know. I don't have any any complaints or any any tips for improving it or anything. Um, seems to be working really well. Um, actually I just thought of one thing. Um, being that this only goes you can see the numbers changing. Uh, I'm just moving my my right stick back and forth. Um, it doesn't go to a hundred still but it is equal at least on both sides and that's I can uh, I can easily change that, well, not change it I guess, I can easily <coughs> uh, understand what I'm changing with uh, calibrating other functions of the remote, like setting endpoints and and dual rate, things like that, I can understand what I'm doing better that way, but um, I don't know if the setting the trim was supposed to make those go to a hundred or not, but um, it gets close, um, and I don't know how that moves my servos, if that moves my servos 100% or not, but uh, the, the calibration is working great for setting all the trims at zero and uh, that's really all I'm concerned with. So uh, thank you very much. Bye.